It's Friday, and you know what that means, another edition of Pet of the Week. Hi everybody, it's Paul Mueller, and of course, we're coming to you again with some furry, lovable, adoptable four-legged friends. And that's why today we are on the road in Nueces County at Nueces County Animal Services. So here we are inside, and this is Mud, and of course this is our resident animal advocate, Lisa Buckholt. Thanks for being here. Lisa, tell us about Mud. That, that, that's his name? The um, animal shelter has a computer program, and it assigns names, and uh, I don't know how he got the name Mud. Um, but he's awful know, cute. We do know he's up for adoption. <laughs> he is up for adoption. Tell us about him. He hasn't had a lot of interest. He showed up uh, on the 16th here at the facility. My mother's birthday, by the way. Nueces County Animal Services. He came in on the 16th, was picked up as a stray out on County Road 81, which is out in the uh, Nueces County, Robstown area. Um, he came in wearing a red collar. That's the collar that he was um, brought in wearing, and nobody has come to look for this sweet little boy. He's a a boxer mix and he's a small size. Um, he's only about, about 43 pounds and so he's not going to be too big if you look at the size of his paws. He's very calm, he's super friendly, seems to be very social, gets along with other dogs here at the shelter. Um, Apparently the other dogs are jealous of him right now. Uh, they want to the be on television, right? yes. So he's a good boy. He is very he's sweet, very shy. Right. So what can people do in order to come uh, to go ahead and uh, possibly express their interest in adopting mud? Well, we, we would appreciate um, uh, if people would set up a meet and greet in advance and do it on a scheduled basis. Um, and, and they can come in, do a meet and greet. They're welcome to bring their own animal. It's important to test them with their own dog and see are they going to get along, if they want to bring their kids along. But come in, do a meet and greet and see if maybe he's right for, not just, for their family. Not just come in and leave with a dog. Yes, no, really it, it, you point. have to have an appointment for lots of reasons, obviously due to the pandemic, but it's also because of staffing. We want people to be um, assisted when they come in, and right. so we have to make sure we've got enough help here. So for more information on MUD, all you have to do is call Nueces County Animal Services, and of course we'll have that information on our website. Lisa, thanks for being here as Thank always. Thank you for having yeah. me. I hope we get you home, buddy. Good luck, MUD. Good we'll see you next time.